Hey, Sean Russell, Top Spot USA, TSUSA Radio. Ah! <laughs> Thank you for joining us. We have Boy Epic on today's show. He talks about his filmmaking, his music, his interesting style, and how he makes it all into one thing. That is Boy Epic. Boy Epic, the Dallas, Texas native, is trying to make a name for himself in the new pop music scene. He defines what makes his project different from all the rest. But the whole boy epic thing, I, I, I just wanted to stay true to myself. And with that being said, I wanted to stay true to whoever was listening to what I was creating. And, I, you know, at the same time, I'm a big fan of movies. So I also wanted to incorporate maybe some filmmaking into it. You know, I, I do all my own videos. And uh, I would love to, you know, uh, create a video for every song that I do. Like many teenagers looking to take the road less traveled, Boy Epic spent his formative years experimenting with different sounds and instruments. He shares some of his early experiences. For the first, you know, two to four years, I was just, you know, I didn't know what I was doing, honestly. I was just trying to do something. I was trying to learn instruments or trying to figure out what I was good at. You know, I, I didn't know if I was good at singing or playing guitar, or bass, drums, you know, what, what have you. But, you know, as soon as I hit high school, I wanted to get serious with it, but I was still learning. Uh, what I was good at at that time. I didn't really figure out that I wanted to sing until I got out of high school. Boy Epic credits his love of music to his family and early musical influences. I, I enjoyed music. You know, I, I grew up in bars and bowling alleys when I was a, a kid. You know, my dad would always play the Stones and the Beatles and the Zeppelin. And, you know, my mother would always play ACDC and then Sticks and all that. So, you know, I always grew up around, like, you know, the whole rock and roll thing and, and everything and just I just saw my, my family is very musically inclined too so I've, I've just been kind of around music my whole life and it just felt natural to me to do it myself. If you go to Boy Epic's Facebook or YouTube page you'll notice a short list of songs. He shares what inspired him to create Too Young to Love. So I, I feel like when people are at a certain age at such a young age when they're still trying to figure life out or figure out who they want to be or figure out what kind of career they want. Sometimes you can't handle all of that and also a commitment such as being in a relationship and that's, that's the message I wanted to give across when I uh, wrote to Under Love. It's just sometimes it's just not the right time. Although most of his music is drawn from personal experiences, Wake the Dead takes a slightly different direction. You know, I've always been a fan of Thriller, of course, and the, the music video was just genius. And I, by, not by any means was I trying to go out and try to create something as amazing as Thriller because I just don't think that could be topped even to this day even though the song and the video is, you know, it's been out for a very, very, very long time. And, you know, I haven't had any personal experience with zombies, but the personal experience that I wanted to put into that was just myself, the, the fun side of myself. And that's and the fun side of life that I like to have and I wanted to bring that into that song. To see where you can find Boy Epic performing live or to listen to his music in its entirety, be sure to check out Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube with the keyword Boy Epic. To get more interviews with the next big things in music, simply go to TopSpotUSA.com. And remember, there's more music out there.